Hey guys, it's me, Power Luigi here, and welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's. And it <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> oh my god! <coughs> Sorry, I'm dying here. Anyways, an indie horror game made by the infamous Scott Cotton, who was cancelled a few months ago, a few months ago for being a Republican. So, yeah. Um, uh, just don't mind all that. Don't Just don't mind when I'm playing a game made by someone that, but I don't really mind it. I still don't like Scott. Anyways, I figured I'd play FNAF 1 again, because I've all, I've been like, I'm starting to get back in my Five Nights at Freddy's mood, where I just want to play all the games again, so we're just going to click on New Game and just start fresh. Help wanted, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, Famous Pizzeria, looking for a security guard to work from night shift 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. Not responsible for injury, injury slash dismemberment. The first night. Man, I'm getting so many flashbacks. We about to see the old office here. God, dude. All the memories I have for, with this game. God, dude, so much nostalgia stuffed in just one game, even where the visuals don't look as great. Hello there, Bonbon. Tricks the Rabbit, as Cory called him. I can't really remember what uh, Markiplier called him. I've never watched Yogi Nash play this game. I watched Jack play, I don't remember what he called him either. Um, I just remember this game back then was so, like, ludicrously big. Like, all it took was just for one person to make a video on it. 
and it just got so big it just it just blew up and then Scott started giving out all the demos to like Corey and uh, Markiplier Jackson the guy Yummy Nash I don't I don't remember if PewDiePie played this game though I, I never watched PewDiePie back in the day I watched some of him but that's really it when I the time I really got interested in him was like around like 2015 and near the time when uh, the map 4 was starting to come out. I hear banging. I remember all like the infamous easter eggs that are in the game too. Hi. Hi. There's an easter egg with him. It's kind of rare. There goes Foxy soon in the back there. Now look, I'm gonna want to tell you guys, playing this game is child's play. Playing Five Nights at Freddy's on a desktop is nothing really major. Like, believe me, it's not. I keep on excellent pointing my mouse like from off the screen. That's the thought about having two monitors. Actually, when I was testing this game earlier today, testing it out on my computer, I already got an Easter egg here that was talking about like the about local pizzeria comes to years end or something like that. I can't remember what all it said, but I did get that Easter egg this morning when I first bought the game. Crazy, I'm buying a game from 2014. But hey, it was five bucks, so why not? Bonnie's coming close to me. He really wants these PMs. Mother bon bon. five. God, dude, I remember how slow the nights used to go. Body. Body. I can't do that. It's something I really. I can't really do the high pitch voice. Uh. Dude, it looks so weird. From this angle, it looks so weird to see a game running at essentially 12, 1280 by 720. It looks so weird to see it running on my massive screen. Like, this screen is big. It's, uh, it's a HP 27mm. There's, there's definitely bigger screens out there, but even then, for me, right now, this one is freaking large. And I love it. Body, come on. You, about, you want to catch this work, Bon Bon? Dude, where'd he go? Oh! Hi, Foxy! I didn't even know you were going out! Okay, I'm gonna want to keep an eye on you. I hear. I remember Chica was the one that scared me back then. I was always scared of Chica. I swear, dude, I'm gonna be perfectly ready if Foxy tries to run. He's coming for me, booty. That tried. Come on, hurry up. It's been about 10 minutes. Got 20 power. We should be good to go. Alright. Well, there you go. 
a.m. already. Yeah! Nice. <laughs> I bet you I'm just going to get scared the crap out of later on. I've been playing this game for about six years. And even well, more than six years, actually. I've been playing this game. Yeah, um, my friend Vance, he, he was the one who showed this game to me. Gosh, Vance was the one who showed this game to me on his phone. So I've been playing ever since he showed me it, which is like seven years ago. Eight years ago, it's about eight years ago ever since I showed him. I won't talk quite as long this time since Freddy and his friends tend to become more active as the week progresses. This game was a big deal to us back then. It still is a big deal for me, but this ain't the same anymore with security. Uh, Security breach enough, is good, but, but I, I just don't, like, it, it's just so based on tasks now, where it's like, it's just a location now, it's just like, uh, I also want to emphasize the importance of using your door lights. It just doesn't uh, make sense, like, why is the camera, camera I felt like the camera should have ended the camera simulator, that was the perfect camera. So, if, if you can't find something, or someone on your cameras, uh, be sure to check the door light. Uh, you might only have a few seconds to react. Uh, not that you would be in any danger, of course. Uh, I'm not implying that. Yes, you are. Uh, also, uh, check on the curtain in Pirate Cove from time to time. The character in there seems unique in that he becomes more active if the cameras remain off for long periods of time. Uh, I guess he doesn't like being watched. Uh -huh. I don't know. Uh, anyway, I'm sure you have everything under control. Remember Golden Freddy would appear right there, and if he uh, jump scared you, he'd crash your game, or if he input 1987 into uh, into the custom night, he'd also crash your game. Is what's starting jump scares you. I wanted to actually wait. It's actually like 2 a.m. right now, in real time. I actually wanted to wait until late night intentionally to play this because, well, it just adds on the emphasis of this game is a horror game. I'm not really scared of this game. Well, not as much as I used to be. Where's I think she can see the picture with all those sounds. I can pick. Can't do it. Still boot bug, uh, good old Freddy though. Oh, hi. Bonnie. Okay, he's back in the hall. I think Cheek is on my. Okay, she's still over there. Sorry about like the lack of commentary right now. Just focused. Even on night two, as early as night two, am I this focused in the game? God, dude, the ambience. The ambience is some. The ambience of FNAF one scares. me. Because, like, it just... Oh, wait, okay, there's the Where's... Okay, Bonnie's right there. God, dude, look at my power just draining. I ain't even doing anything. I'm only looking at cameras and turning on the lights. Hi. I told you guys I'm still scared of this game. Well, just not as much as I used to be as, like... Seven-year-old, eight-year-old—I don't know. Vance showed the game to me in a wrestling tournament, so likely when I was eight. Oh my God, dude. Yes, yeah, seven because of 2014. So, there you go. Yawn. Okay, I'm not sure if I can't get my door anymore. I always thought, as a kid, I always thought these were just gates instead of curtains. I never knew they were curtains until like a few years ago. Like, I always just thought those were like metal sheets blocking off boxing or something. They were just able to pry through them. 
That's what I always thought as a kid. But I remember this was just a daily tragedy inside of FNAF 1. Have on the camera and shut both the freaking doors. That was always just my strategy, but now I'm like at 44%. So we're gonna go here. He's not coming out of the I actually do know of like a lot of Easter eggs in this game. There's a uh, over here you can see the crying child posters. Uh, this could either turn into Golden Freddy or, or Freddy grabbing his jaw and twisting it out of his uh, face. Uh, right here it could change to uh, a closing notice. Someone's probably at my door. It's only 3 a.m. Yep, there you go. I found it. There it is, right there. There's the. There's the funny Easter egg. Alright. Yeah, right here, there would be another Easter egg. There would be a Golden Freddy right here. The. All. The heads and the. Um, and the endoskeleton in this room would stare at you. Freddy would occasionally stare at you here. It's only 4 a.m. and I'm at 20%. I'm definitely gonna get killed. Unless if I just get lucky. But I don't really, I don't really think that's gonna happen. I always thought, I, I think every night is like 10 minutes, so it should be like close there. If I'm looking at the timer on my OBS, I, I think. I oh, boxy. All right. Seriously, though, we're gonna wanna have to stop looking at cameras. We're only gonna check on pirate code, so we're just gonna not drain our power. I think Chief is on my right. All the hearing you had to do with this game is like the precursors of uh, FNAF 4. Because FNAF 4, which is all hearing, ha! Ah, I almost clicked off my game. That literally scared me. She gets in the kitchen. Alright, it's dude. When is it gonna turn five? There. Yeah, 50%. I think we're done. God, dude. Seriously, though, I just have so many memories memories with this game. I just clicked it off. Oh no. I just clicked off the game. Whoops, sorry guys. Ah, guys, leave me alone. Nine percent. Oh no. Oh! Oh, dude, I almost got Markiplier right there. I almost just now got Markiplier to freak out of right there. Y'all remember Night 2? Um, Foxy ran out and he didn't shut the door in time. I almost just now got Markiplier. Yeah, that's what I like to call it. Okay, that's enough. There we go! 6 a.m. Yeah. Found some Easter eggs. That's nice. That's, uh, that's something nice. Alright, well, should I keep going or should I just end the video? I'm gonna end the video. I I've got too much to edit, anyways. Well, guys, that right now, right that for now is Five Nights at Freddy's 1. It's not over yet, don't worry. I'm gonna try 100% this game by, uh, Beat night five, no duh, then trying to beat uh, six night, and I might, I might, and who knows, I may try 420 mode. If I'm just willing for it, I may try 420 mode. But for now, this is just, I'm just ending off on a good note. 
so thank you guys so much for watching this new video of Five Nights at Freddy's 1. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to support the channel. It helps me out a lot. And I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.